Welcome to the instructional video on how to collect your blood sample using the dry blood spot test by RX Home Test. When you first receive your test kit, check the contents. The kit includes one blood collection card, one test requisition form, a band-aid, a cotton gauze, an alcohol pad, two lancets, and a prepaid return envelope. Place them out for easy use. Before collecting the sample, please check the instruction sheet carefully for collection times and other requirements for this test. When collecting your blood sample, you want as much blood circulating through your hands as possible. Before starting the test, rotate your arms and shoulders. Massage from your shoulders to your fingers for blood flow. On the dry spot blood card, clearly write your name and date of collection. Additionally, clearly fill out the requisition form and sign it. Any missing information may delay your results. Step 1. Clean your hands with soap. Wash under warm water and dry thoroughly. Open the cotton gauze for easy access during and after the completion of the collection. Then, go ahead and choose either the ring finger or the middle finger on your non-dominant hand to wipe with the provided alcohol pads. This will be the finger that you will collect the blood sample from. Allow the alcohol to dry for 20 to 30 seconds. Step 2. Twist open the lancet. Only turn, do not pull. To avoid sore fingers, take the blood sample from either side of the intended finger and not the tip of the finger. Step 3. Press the lancet firmly against the side of the clean finger. The lancet is designed to make a gentle trim, not a poke. It will make a click similar to a pen. If it is not pressed down firmly, it might result in insufficient blood for the sample and you may need to do it again on a different finger. Wipe off the first blood drop with a cotton gauze. Massage the finger to form a large hanging blood drop. Step 4. Place the drop over one of the circles on the dry spot blood card. Let it drop into the circle. Do not touch the finger to the card. Touching the card will prevent the blood from filling the circle completely. Also, do not drop more than one drop of blood in the circle as it might affect your results. It is okay if the blood drop falls outside the circles. Let the blood soak through the card to form full circles. It is important that you see the blood absorbed on the back of the card as well. Without full circles of blood absorbed through the card, the lab cannot use your sample. Step 5. When done, gently wipe off excess blood with the cotton gauze and wrap your finger with a band-aid. Leave the blood spot card open for at least 30 minutes. After it's dry, close the flap and place it into the provided biohazard plastic bag. Store in a cool, dry place until you are ready to mail. Step 7. Appropriately dispose of any used supplies. Step 8. Please double check the requisition form and blood card for any missing information that might delay your results. Drop the prepaid envelope in the mail when ready. Congratulations, you are done collecting your blood sample for the dry blood spot test by RX Home Test. Visit rxhometest.com for more information.